everybody. Good morning. This is Carrie. <sighs> right now, I am in Peru and we are in Puno bus station. And Puno is right on the Lake Titicaca, which borders Bolivia. So today, we're leaving Peru after almost a month of amazing adventures here. And we're going into Bolivia, finally. So today we're going to Copacabana, which is on the Bolivian side of Lake Titicaca. So I'm really excited to go to Bolivia. I've been wanting to go there for such a long time and just so excited. So let's see, time check. It is seven and we bought tickets to take this bus in Cusco. And we were told the bus leaves at seven and we already paid for it and everything, but we came here and they said, well, actually, don't know about the tickets. So they changed it, put us on a different bus and now we're leaving at 7.30. So sometimes things change when you're backpacking and you just end up on a different bus or leaving at a different time or leaving by a different company and you just have to kind of fly with it. So that's what we've been doing. Peru has been so good to us. It's been so amazing. We've done so many crazy things. Sandboarding, flying over the Nazca lines, like almost like crop circles, like swimming, just loving Cusco, buying really crazy boots and souvenirs and things. It's been really, really fun. Eating quinoa soup. Oh, it's just a delicious country. <laughs> so we're happy to be moving on, but we're also sad to leave Peru. Uh, I'll show you my breakfast today from the bus station. It's a bun with like salty cheese in it and I just had a little tea to go with it. It's very very nice. So um, yeah just kind of updating you with where we are. Uh, we've already been to Machu Picchu and I made so many videos that I don't even know how I'm gonna begin to upload them. There's probably about 40 that need to be all stitched together so I should have them up in the next little while but I just wanted to make a little update to let you know that we're leaving Peru and heading into Bolivia and we've been on the road for about three months and we have two months left so yeah it's really exciting and I'm really thinking about Korea a lot these days and excited to be going back um, if not in December, in January, I'll definitely be there. And I know you guys, some some of you subscribe to my videos just for stuff about Korea. And thank you for being patient for watching my other videos about travel because it's a big part of my life as well. So appreciate that very much. Wow, I am so tired. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go get on the bus and then I'm gonna talk to Brenna about her impressions of Peru and what has been happening. Gracias. I already explained to her that I was going to make a video, so get on the bus. I just explained that I was going to ask you oh. about your impression of Peru and maybe favorite place. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That is a you, don't have to, you don't have to say favorite, just general impression. Okay. Okay, so here's Brenna from this battered suitcase with a few little impressions of Peru. I was not prepared for this at all. <laughs> this is sprung on me at 7 in the morning. Um, I really like Peru. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie. 7 in the morning. Um, not going to lie. For some reason, I wasn't as excited to go to Peru as I was, for example, for Colombia or Bolivia. Mm -hmm. But Peru just completely wowed me and surprised me in its diversity of places yes. and how kind and warm the people were, especially our homestay, like Titicaca, and just how much fun we had doing everything. And I would say my, you know, my favorite places, but the moments were like, wow. Yes. Seeing whales in Minecraft. Mm -hmm. Uh, the Nazca Limes, definitely. Yes. Obviously Machu Picchu. Yes. It's amazing. And probably being with the family yeah. the past two days in Lake Titicaca. And just being with Carrie. Yeah. And it's awesome. <laughs> and celebrating her birthday and <laughs> yeah, having a great time. Yeah. yeah. And just being in Cusco, walking around. Yeah. Yeah, I really, really, really had a great time in Peru. But mm -hmm. also very excited. What's that in your lap there? Um, I was just reading it. We had to fill it out all in Spanish, so. Oh, okay. But it's pretty easy. Is it's it just the, the entrance form, form for Bolivia? Oh, yeah. okay. Thankfully, we don't. I don't think we have to pay anything. Oh, that's good. Americans have to pay 135. 135. Sometimes it's good to be Canadian. <laughs> 49. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, but yeah. Sign off then. So, 
we're sad to leave, but we're also happy to keep moving. So thank you for Peru. Thank you for Peru. Thank you to Peru for being lovely and delicious and exciting and really cool. So bye, Peru. See you. Love you. Bye.